certified free, seven days a week, wet ass pussy, make that pull up game weak. Yeah, yeah, fucking pussy, wet ass pussy, get a bucket and a mop for this wet ass pussy, give me everything you got for this wet ass pussy, beat it up baby, catch a charge, extra large and extra hard. Wipe your nose like a credit card. Hop on top. Park that big mad truck right in this little garage. Got him to swallow me. Get your boots and your coat. I'm a hard hitter. I need a weed smoker. Oh, that's why I'm headed. I'm trying to whip. He's a bottom feeder. Let me know before I ever meet you. He came back with a lot of pain. I'm gonna spend my Yeah. Bring a bucket and a mop for this wet ass. Everything you got. Hey guys, this is Queen Rena, High Priestess, Ascendant Master number 11. Okay, so I wanted to play that song. Hopefully they keep it up because I did play the a, a split the split it um version. So it's not the uh, clean version, it's the, the dirty version, okay? Okay, so I want to come in here and um make a little short video for you guys about the divine feminine and also divine masculine um you know higher vibrating people this 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 does not apply to lower vibrating people who want to do all type of craziness and all type of fuck shit um and treat each other bad and um just anything any any type of low vibration thing that they want to do this is not for relationships like that this is higher vibrating people who have some sense who is of higher energies this is not this this does not apply to people of a lower energies okay okay so i'm gonna make that that note there okay so the divine feminine and also the divine masculine especially the you know twin flames and the higher like soulmate and uh, higher type of couples here you you and your divine masculine, divine feminine, and also the divine masculine, you both have the same energies inside, of course. Um, but in the feminine body, the feminine energy is supposed usually um, goes to the for, the, the forefront here. Um, and it's also inside your core. Like if you look at the yin yang sign, you have the feminine in, energy inside, and then you have the masculine energy, which protects, but you are really your feminine energy your feminine energy is what rules your energy rules you and for the masculine your masculine version your other half 
Um, cause both you guys are whole, uh, by itself, but together y'all balance each other out and y'all complete each other. Just like the, the yin yang sign. Okay. Okay. So for the masculine version, um, his power is inside and then you, and then your energy divine feminine, um, is surrounding him. If you look at the, the yin yang sign. And so you both in each body, you both help and you both protect each other in different ways. Okay. So for the divine feminine, divine masculine, like for fem for the feminine, you, you know, you all loving and sweet and all this type of stuff, caring and uh, all, you know, all those nice loving things. So you have to be balanced out with your, your masculine energy. And so your masculine energy is your actual masculine that's in another body. Okay. That is his actual energy. And right now I'm getting uh, Jay-Z because Jay-Z and also Beyonce, Beyonce, Beyonce is a high priestess goddess. She's just like the same energy. She's the same as what I am. Okay. And so people always talk about her talking about, oh, she have a deep voice. And, and, and then all of a sudden, sometimes you'll say, oh, she's, she's sweet or something like that. Um, that is because divine, um, Beyonce is a high priestess goddess. She is a balanced higher being. Okay, and also um, Jay Z is too. Okay, and so that sweet, uh, loving energy that some people talk about, that is her, and that is the divine feminine energy. And the energy that's surrounding, sometimes they'll say, oh, she's mean. Oh, oh, she's a, a bee. Oh, oh, she's, she handled her business. Oh, she this, or oh, she that. That is, that is Jay Z's energy that surrounds her. Like if you look at the yin yang sign, okay. That is Jay-Z's Jay energy, the dark part that you see around there, okay? And then the light part is the loving. That's the feminine part. So that's how, um, that's why you, you get those. And that's why she also has a deeper voice. With goddesses, both of us are in the same body, but the fem in the female, female body, usually, the, fem the female side is, comes out with the masculine, with the masculine energy protecting it. And then for um, Jay-Z, his energy is inside because sometimes you you know he, he he makes a lot of money okay and he gets business taken care of and all that that's because of his energy his dark energy inside which is his power self but then he also has his uh energy on the outside which is the feminine energy which is um beyonce's energy which helps him balance out that's why you see him lay back cool calm and collected he is balanced okay He's able to be loving. He's able to do all that stuff because he has Beyonce's energy surrounding it. Okay. And so with Jay-Z and Beyonce, which is a good, a good example because you, everybody knows them. You see them in the, in the forefront. Okay. So you got the feminine and you got uh, the masculine, Jay-Z and also Beyonce. And so they work together. Uh, try to be as balanced as possible. I'm not saying that this couple is uh, as... Um, have vibration or you know doing all the right things because they do have things that they need to work on but they are still a good example for you to see and understand these energies that's going on so because i've heard um people say oh beyonce she did she did sometimes they'll say she oh she's sweet or she she's helping or she's got this good music or she's a boss or she you know she got a, a deep i've heard people say oh she got a deep voice goddesses have uh, goddesses can talk deeper. They have deeper voices because they have their masculine energy inside of They have, just like Beyonce, she has Jay-Z's energy in there, okay? In inside of her uh, her energy field. That is how goddesses and uh, masculines, they are. You'll see the masculine able to let, uh, be cool, calm, collected, like Jay-Z is able to do, get things taken care of without acting a straight fool, you know, without getting in trouble, getting, you know, shot out here in these streets. Because he has his feminine energy protecting him from acting a stone food. Protecting from his power from going too crazy, you know? And the same with, uh, with, uh, divine, with the divine feminine. With um, Beyonce. Instead of, you know, sometimes you can see that she's super sweet or whatever. But So that's why she has to have her, her masculine energy, which is Jay-Z, um, balancing her out, and so that's why you also see her being a bitch sometimes. Or if somebody do something crazy or says something crazy, you people I've heard people say that she can be um, kind of bitchy sometimes. 
okay? Because that is she's balanced, okay? And he's balanced. So that's just, a, you know, a little example there because when you got divine feminine, you got the divine masculine out here. Um, you know, divine masculine is working in the garden or working out here in the fields and doing all this type of stuff, doing whatever work he's doing. He don't have time to be worried and be like, oh, is my damsel in distress um, being uh, tricked or being uh, taken advantage of or, or having a hard time and some, some snake uh, motherfucker or somebody coming up with some poisonous apples or something like that. He don't have time for that. He don't have time to be worried about his damsel and her being in, in the distress. Okay, because he have to go out. He can't be with her all the time. He can't be sitting, oh, I got to protect you all day long or whatever. He got to go out in the street. He got to do, do things. And so that is why Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, you are balanced. Okay, because you doing what you need to do or whatever. Over here doing your little work, whatever. He do over here. He do his little work. And he don't need to be, oh, I'm so scared. Oh, I don't oh, I got to go see. I got to watch her. I got to be watching her every moment. He don't have time for that. He got to do other stuff. Okay. Oh, he don't want he don't want no no snake motherfuckers out here sitting up there giving his damsel poisonous apples and all this type of things. Okay? And the same thing with divine feminine. You don't want to be worried, oh, is my masculine he out here getting shot or he out here getting killed or he out here getting going crazy or tearing stuff up or whatever. That's why he is balanced with his feminine and masculine energy. And that's why your divine feminine is balanced with your feminine and your masculine energy. So you know that each other is going to be good when y'all are apart. And then when y'all come together, y'all do this little dance. Okay? Y'all do it because you both have each other's energy. So you might be looking at your masculine like, up there using all my love energy to do all these things that you're doing. So you might, and then he might be looking at you like, up there having fun with my, up there having fun with my masculine energy. Okay, all right. So y'all do this little dance when y'all you when you're the masculine and the feminine and y'all is together. Y'all gonna be doing this little dance because y'all both have each other energies. So you you divine feminine, you could be using your feminine energy. Then you can use your masculine energy, and then your masculine he can use his his masculine energy, and then he can you can he can use his feminine energy, and y'all just do each, each other dances by just looking looking at each other energy flowing through. Okay, and y'all gonna be just enjoying each other and just having a good time with each other because you're literally looking at yourself. <laughs> okay, so it's like masculine, feminine, and then you can do your masculine and your feminine. So you just looking at each other, doing it. Y'all gonna be doing a little dance together because sometimes you might be in your masculine energy and sometimes you might be in your feminine energy. Sometimes he might be in his feminine and his masculine, and y'all just enjoy seeing yourselves in each other. So it's gonna be a dance. It's gonna be a constant dance with each other. And y'all have to um, learn how to get along, okay? And y'all need to learn. Y'all gonna have to. Y'all gonna have to learn this. This is one thing y'all gonna have to learn is how to get along. Cause some of y'all is yeah. Some of y'all, you don't you you get pissed off at your mask or you get pissed off you you get pissed off at yourself because you really, if you in your higher self, you vibrating high and you know yourself, you're really getting pissed off at yourself. So you're going to have to learn how to get along with yourself, love yourself, because your masculine, the outer version of you, is going to show you all parts of you. Now, both you guys had um, different life experiences, so your whole, you know, within your own selves, each person is whole within their own selves, but still, you will notice that you... Uh, divine feminine and divine masculine you will notice that both of you guys literally have like the same type of energies the same type of soul the same type of things that's going on some of you guys divine uh the masculines and, and divine feminists you guys has could have had similar uh learning experiences and issues and problems and stuff going up growing up as well but still you are two separate people healing yourselves Making sure that you're whole and complete and one and then y'all come together and y'all complete each other even more and balance each other out and help heal each other even more on an even grander mass scale. Okay, so that's how that's that's how that's gonna go. That's how that goes. 
and you're just gonna be doing a little dance together, just flowing different energies together, okay? Little, little tango dance or something like that, okay? So I just wanted to come on here, let you guys know that. Hope you guys are having, um, or I know that school is supposed to be starting uh, pretty soon here. And a lot of y'all is getting ready for school. So hope you and you know your kiddos is safe. Y'all doing well and you know staying protected because we've still got all this craziness, all type of things people aren't sure about. All. So I hope you guys staying safe, hon, which I know a lot of you guys are. Okay. So um also if you want any all natural products uh for your hair, skin, facial, I do have like uh, deodorants, body butters, facial scrubs, facial moisturizers, things like that. Okay, so uh, also on my website, which is down below. Also, if um, if you want any of my uh, services, uh, my links is below. I do have a four-week high vibration class where I help you raise your vibration, get your vibration high, so you can attract and keep those good things that are meant for you in your life. You can rise above, rise above the bull crap that's going on. So being high vibration, that is what helps you uh live cohesive in this world instead of just going whatever which way the wind is blowing and, and all type of craziness is going on so i have the four week high vibration classes for that okay guys so you can check that out check out my other services as well also i'm going to donate to my channel you can donate as well i want to thank everybody who's already gotten services and gotten um products and donated i want to thank you guys already Mwah. For that, okay? So, peace and love to you guys, okay? Mwah.